today I'm going to teach you to do it with me. Okay, so now before I forget, today we are going to make a mirror cat. Maybe you don't know what that is. Well, that is a cat which has a C tail. Okay, now does anyone have their paper? Yeah? Okay, let's begin. So it gets blue. Or another C color that you like. It can be dark blue. It can be light blue. It can be light purple. It has to be a C color though. Then you make a line. Whoosh. It doesn't have to be straight because actually we have to go a little bit curly this time. So don't worry about your hand traveling. Okay. And then you color that. Color that you can go like this, baby, baby. Or you can do like this. Or you can make your own. Then you can maybe you can do your own way of coloring it in. Well, I know this takes a long time and you la 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 and you think you're bored and la la la. So, but then you can always make a, a make up a game. What if you made you have to go t 10 times on one spot and then move. The octopus would like to have 10, 10 little snacks and then move. So then, you can sing this song, Octopus, get ten snacks and then move, Octopus, get ten snacks and then move. You can sing that song if you think it takes very long to color all of this in. And I have this a lot, you go like this and you have this. Well. Then the best thing is just get a mark or something and put it here and then hold it while you're drawing on that spot. Just hold it like this. And slowly you will go out and out and then you can put your finger there. Okay. And so if you are done already, then you can either pause the video and quickly do something else, or you could just wait. And there we go, the sea washing. Then, when you're done with that, but you still, but, so you can do the sea on your whole, whole paper, or you could do a small green hill over here. So that's what I'm gonna do, a small green hill. And on this, I'm gonna make a tree. And do you know what on the, a lot of kids, they like something that will be hanging from this tree. They, a lot of kids, when they're younger, they like it. But when they're older, they don't really like to sit on it anymore. I will not tell you it yet. Because if I tell you, then you already know. And then you can pause this video and just continue yourself. But now, I am just going to... I'm just going to make it so that the tree will look as if it's like a hook. Have you ever seen a tree which looks like a hook? I don't. But maybe you could make a hook which looks like a butterfly. A hook that like looks like anything you imagine. So, and then... 
if you already have this green mountain, then you can stop and just wait, or you can just pause the video and quickly go somewhere else to do something or get something, and then you can come back. Okay, so now we have this green mountain. Maybe you're thinking, why do you have to do a green mountain? You can also do trees in the sea, right? Yes, you can. But on, on, on the other hand, it's not really, you know, something who, which is exists because I have never seen a tree floating and standing up. Most of the trees are in the water and they're like this instead of straight. So you could make a really strong tree which is standing in the water. You could. But I am going to make a tree which is on a small island. I'm sure you can use brown, but today I'm going to use orange. And then you can whoop, go over here. Now let's make some branches together. La 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 la. So this looks like a hook, right? You can make a hook, which is like this. Or you can make a hook from your imagination, like I said. And then when you have this, then you can just wait for me or or like i said before do something else of course you can do this one color and then this rainbow color you could or you could do this the same color as this you can make a tree which you imagined, a tree maybe you've seen before. But you know, all trees are different, so you don't have to do the exact same tree that you saw before. Not all trees look the same. Some trees are very big and some trees are very tiny. And then, of course, you could also leave it like this, but I'm going to add some leaves. some extra little branches on here or you could leave it like this okay and then you can choose for example black and then you can make a sort of loop around the tree around the hooky bits then make it like this and make another hoop and then when you make two loops, make a sort of seat over here. I told you ooh, that it would be something that kids love, and it is. It's a swing. So now you can make either a seamer man, a seamer, a seamer maid, or a seamer cat, like I'm gonna do. Well, the first thing you need is. Choose a skin color. I'm going to choose this skin color. And then make a small head. Like a woman. And then color it in. Then make a small neck if you want to. And two hands over here. And then two little ears. And then you make a little point 
sticky things. And then over here, and over here, and over here. But don't do the whole body of a cat. Of course, stop over here. Then get another color. Your favorite color or a color that you imagined. And then go like this. You go like this, and then like this. You go like this, and then like this. And then you color it in. Then you can choose the same or a different color and make the tail. And when you made a tail, then you could either say, I want to stop, or you could say, well, I'm going to make this. It's up for the Seymour cats. And then when you have this, you can choose another color, for example, golden or your favorite color. And then you can make hair. And little eyes. And a mouth. Well, then, of course, you could make little dropples over here of the water. You could also make some birds flying. And you can also make a little butterfly. And here we go. Uh, what is it called? Yes, Seymour Cat. See you next time.